What's going on everybody? We're going to teach you how to saddle up Western and English. First part is the saddle pad. You want to make sure that you get it even with their spine. And then you also want to make sure that you have it high enough on them so that when the girth comes down, it's right in line, right behind their shoulder. Next, you've got the saddle. You want to make sure that you throw it all the way up over them. Make sure you can clear that stirrup. You want to get it centered up. Usually, you can look at the back of the saddle, line it up with a saddle pad, and then line it up with their spine. I give it a lift right here in the front. On this particular horse, I usually just walk everything around. I usually don't like to throw it over, even on a uh, on a really broke horse. Sometimes it can startle them. You just want to make sure that everything is kind of ready to go for you to cinch it up. On the other side, make sure your stirrup is out of the way and everything is hanging just right. Next, you're going to take here, go right up underneath your horse, pull it up just so, run it through. I usually like to run it through two times the first time and then once they kind of breathe for a second, I'll go ahead and do it a third time. You just want to get it snug so that if old blue duck runs off, it's not going to twist on him. Then I do the breast collar, pull it around. I go through this top ring that kind of holds it up over his shoulders. And then the second one goes through your cinch. And as you can see, the cinch is in a perfect line right down behind his shoulder. I'll throw this up here for now. And then you're back. I'm being a little careless with how I'm doing this just because this horse is really broke, but if you got one that spooks a little bit, you may want to take your time and be a little bit easier. So that's how you do it.